All right. Thank you for staying with us right now on Daybreak. We're still talking about taming the digital lenders. Faisal here insists that he's part of the KDF team, so he'll just stand. Wow. I'm actually the commander of <laughs> the KDF team. And before we actually uh, go forward uh, with this, Kevin, there's a question that Trevor had asked before we went on break, and that is where do you get your money? And if you actually do get from financial institutions, at what rate do you repay this at? Thank you. Um, we, we, it's very difficult for digital lenders at the moment to get capital from the local markets. One would think that the banks, uh, particularly those that are still struggling to find profitability, would be partnering with us because we've made so much uh, in terms of strides in figuring out <coughs> difficult things that they still can't figure out. Um, so majority of us get money from abroad. Um, we've got uh, what we call venture capital money from the US, we've got venture capital from the UK, China, Poland, um, and a, a lot of it is in the euro and dollar format. Uh, that already makes it expensive because you have a currency risk uh, you have to price in. Um, and then usually we are being charged uh, anything between 18 to 22 percent. Um, on the shilling or you know eight to fifteen percent on private the private equities hedge funds private banks no, not the yet. JP I Morgans no, JP people like JP Morgan for example will will invest <coughs> only in a regulated entity and the and the amount of money they want to invest is usually hundred million dollars or, 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 or more Cla yes. yeah anything less is a waste of mm, their time mm. uh, um, so <coughs> You know, th so they're not yet in the market. They're waiting for us to mature a little bit, and then they come into the market. And that's why the venture capital, which is usually that first investor in most businesses, is what is in the market today. Mm. So right. you first pay a, a range of 18 to 22 yeah. percent, and that has to be factored in. Yes. So that then the, it means then that that amount is pushed back. To the person who's borrowing yes right that's why he was explaining the tomato a, in, crisis yeah and that's the yes. interesting part of it does that make sense reginald from where you stand um, is it sustainable in the long run the, the problem with interest rates for borrowing for any corporate or anyone starting business especially in dollars and euros uh, has been messed up with again uh, sorry to say the biggest problem in this country is the government if the government borrows at nine percent on the euro bond market that is now considered the risk-free rate Anyone wants to come borrow in dollars is not going to get a loan for less than nine percent, whether you are Safaricom, EABL, or whoever, because the government is a sovereign. So if your sovereign is borrowing at nine, you cannot be less riskier than a sovereign which you are uh, yeah. operating inside. Yeah. So the minimum is nine percent you're going to get in dollars, which is hideous, mm -hmm. considering most U.S. markets, Western markets, Japan, uh, interest rates are at zero point something percent. So if you look at someone saying, I would rather lend to the U.S. government a five-year at 0.4%, but I'll lend that same five-year to the Kenyan government at 9%, just shows you how economic uh, outlook is risky and considered so risky. So if their source of funds is expensive, mm -hmm. then the question that comes is, is it going to be a sustainable business model? Um, but then the question comes in, is there a project in Kenya you are you borrow at eight percent yeah that's your cost of borrowing you have your cost of whatever you need to do in that project you're doing that you've borrowed at 38 percent so let's say another four five percent because you're running a business you also want to make profit two three percent mm -hmm. yeah which project in kenya is giving you a return of more than 50 percent none so who are they lending to Hey. <laughs> Those are very pertinent questions. Wow. Being yeah, uh, maybe just to bring in, uh, I 